Um, I just gotta say, this entire thing is just crazy, to be honest. First off, I gotta apologize for how the entire situation was misconstrued. Um, because, I mean, I had a conversation with Chi Chi. Um, I think it was at Beauty's um, house party, where she told me, because I asked her, um, a lot of this news flew online and you said nothing about it. What happened? What is it? And she said that that's her uncle. She went on a visit and they took that picture. So I asked her, why didn't you tell your uncle to put out a disclaimer? And she said, it just put them in a more difficult situation because it was already difficult for them, um, family members. That's what she said. So I already had confirmed that them news was false. And I know for a fact that nobody went out there to confirm nothing. So I was literally laughing at the impossibility of the entire situation. Like, it's not even true. None of it, a process fact, none of it. That was what I was laughing at. Like, how can you make such a force over something that is not proven, in fact? <laughs> and for those of y'all coming at me and saying that, why did I laugh and this? Man, I don't get y'all. Like, do y'all really think that I'm like that? Like, for real? Boss, I hear Jerry. Do y'all really think like it's, it's it's not even the case because y'all see me and some of y'all calling me a habilist. It's not an insult. <laughs> I'm very spiritual. And if you know not anything, hey about me, let's share If you know anything about spirituality, it means heightened sensitivity. I'm sensitive and I've been through a lot. But I said it best, like best we don't suffer supposed guess sense. Like there's no way I'd be laughing at such a serious shit. I was laughing because all of it was just not true. And they made such fuss over it. Like, I never benefited from drama. I was in that house. Y'all watched me, so you know the truth. And those of y'all who are disappointed truly over how it might have been perceived, I truly apologize for how it might have been perceived. But I wasn't laughing at then, so I already had confirmed facts. Because I talked to Chi Chi and she told me all of that. Why she didn't clear it. You know, like... <laughs> So, y'all just keep my name out the dirt, please. Like, I ain't even want to do any of that. Y'all know that for a fact. Honestly, the aftermath of this reunion is going to be very, very long. And it will be very, very dramatic if care is not taken. Because, guys, we are on a very serious long thing. And at this point, Hermes is on Chichi's side. Kes and Bella, they are on Fina's side. And these people, they have actually speak up. And we on this side is actually going to be speaking our truth based on the evidences, based on some of the things we've seen, and based on some of the facts we have, we are actually going to be giving our two cents in all of this. Because, hmm, no be smart, you know, welcome to my channel, let me welcome all of you. If you are new on this channel, please click on the subscribe button, click on the notification bell button, and please do not forget to give this particular video a very big thumbs up or more at this point a lot of people have been dragging Hermes calling Hermes out saying why will he be accusing Fina of lying how did he know Chi Chi him and Fina who was the first person to know Chi Chi who is now going to be telling us the truth and who is not going to be telling us the lie why other people on the other hand is seriously thanking him giving him all the accolade he deserved for walking up to Chi Chi to ask her the question for actually coming out to speak out for Chi Chi for coming out to clear Chichi name or more. No, this what you know, like it has been a different and mixed reaction between people who believe and people who do not believe what Hermes was saying. Am I going to be dragging Hermes? No, I am not actually going to be dragging Hermes because Omo, um, Hermes is speaking up for himself because people actually attacked him, trying to find out his reason, why he was laughing, why the altercation between Fina and Chichi was going on. Like the dragon and the attack really got to him that he has to do this video and speak up for himself. And in the process of speaking up for himself, he actually said that, okay, he actually implied that Fina was lying and Chichi is the one that is speaking the truth because he gets his information from from the source, from the person that is being talked about. Um, no be smarting, no. No be smarting. And to be very, very sincere and honest with you guys, if Chichi is lying, it is not up to her mess to know because the truth is with Chichi, the ex-husband 
involved if the man have not moved on and God. And if none of them is actually coming to speak the truth, to be sincere with you guys, there is no way we can know the truth. You know, Chichi is the one that concealed the information if we are actually going to go by what we have at hand. Chichi concealed the information and there is no way she is actually going to be open. There is no way she is actually going to be realistic to Hermes. And Hermes, on the other hand, believed everything Chichi told him to be truth because for Hermes, everything Chichi said was true and he didn't even notice that there was a sign of lie in what Chichi said because how could Hermes tell us this? So I asked her, why didn't you tell your uncle to put out a disclaimer? And she said, it was just put them in a more difficult situation because it was already difficult for them. Um, family members. Seriously, this is the most blatant lie that someone is shoving down on our throats on internet that I have ever seen. Like, nobody is going to help Big Brother Niger organizers and nobody is actually going to help the production to come and buy watch Chi Chi on our very before. Whoever that is doing that will definitely look stupid to me because how busy will Chi Chi's family be that none of the family member, none of her relative, both from her mother's side, both from her father's side, who come out and speak up for Chichi to tell us that the story flying up and down is really, really false. And guys, to be honest, this story is not adding up. The story did not add up at all and there is no way we are actually going to believe it and nobody is actually going to help organizers, as I have earlier said, to come and make it seem as though Chichi is the saint. Chichi has nothing in her cupboard and everything Fina said was a lie. Ah, God do. Like, at this point, eh, it is not adding up and in this internet, we are not actually going to condone anybody that is going to forsake or that is going to conceal his or her family from us because he or she is actually coming to reality show and we deserve and we have all the right to know their previous story. And if somebody attacked them, if somebody accused them that they are lying, we need a receipt to know that these people they were actually lying. And without that receipt, we are not actually going to believe that story. Like some of you will come under the comment section and say, SLF City, you've come again. SLF City, you did this one. SLF City, you are, you, are, you are fighting for Fina. You are crying for Fina. You are doing this one for Fina. You are doing that one for Fina. Yes, I am actually going to speak it for Fina because if everybody is not making it seem as though that um, Chichi is the same, Chichi did not, uh, like Fina is the one that lied or to, Fina is the one that did this one and that one or more, I am actually going to also speak out and ask questions concerning Chichi because guys, I'm not speaking up for Fina. I'm actually asking questions. I'm actually looking into all the things that they are saying and I am here saying that the story should make sense so that like it is not as though I cannot believe the story if it makes sense but let it make sense. Let them make it make sense. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I beg, this is where I'll be ending this particular video. Thanks for watching to this point.